Hi guys, welcome back to our channel, Shelly the Learnings. Today we are coming up with the, with the very interesting topic called Logical Building. We will not be going from one for course at all to learn our different languages for data analytics or data science. For example, the reporting or the visualization, you are learning Excel, Power BI, Tableau, or a bit more on the analysis tool like SQL, Azure, or other things, and recently it is Python in the fame, and people are going behind that and spending a lot of money. But before going to uh, these courses, you have to first build your logical mind. Uh, how you have to build your logical mind? Well, come out of this video. So we'll start from Excel there, then we will go to the SQL, then we'll go to the different languages, we'll cover them there. So before going to any language, before learning to any language, we have to uh, learn the logical building. Alright, so the first part, how you have to build a logical mind. Uh, I'll give you a few examples, so by this you will you will easily understand the advanced analysis, right? So don't go with the, with the Excel part, don't, don't think about Excel, it will automatically convert you into the formula analysis. So first we have to build the logical mind and thereafter we will start working on the different languages, right? So, if I, if, if the, uh, for example, if there is a, there's a rack, right? There's a cupboard, I would say, or whatever you want to say. It has some racks, right? How many racks it has? For example, it has 3, 4, 5, 5, 9, 10, 12, whatever it is. So these are the racks 1, 2, 3, 4. And these are the cells, right? First cell which is my A, B, C, and D. We are just giving you an example according to the Excel, so you will understand easily, right? Each cell that is called, for the basic users, those who don't aware of the Excel part, this is called cells, right? So don't, don't go to the, the Excel part, I mean, don't relate it. For example, if somebody asks you, um, find uh, Hindi book, right? Okay, I'm, I'm a teacher, for example, I'm a teacher. And I ask you, go to that room, there is a right, there is a cell, and bring in the book for me. Okay, so what do you need for that? I mean, if I say, go to that room, bring this book. So the first thing, you'll go there, you'll find the new struggle, okay, there are four or five, and then you'll ask again. Uh, so which rack of itself self are you to bring? There are multiple Hindi books. For example, this is class one, right, it's class two. If this is class 3, this is class 4, right? And, and these are the racks, right? 2010, 2011, 2020, 2023, so on, right? 23. So if I ask you, go to that room and there's a self, uh, there's a cupboard I mean, and bring class 2 in the book of 2011, right? So you, you'll go to that room, you'll see, okay, class 2nd book, 2nd class and 2011 book I have to bring in this book, so in the book I have, I have spread out, right, from there. Then I came back and I spread out, right? So if you have to make um, a machine to learn this, right? Like how, how your brain learns, the similar way a machine would learn. How, how your brain learns. So what do you need first? I mean, uh, so you need to search first in the book, right? So this is your search area, search thing that you have to find. Then what else you need? You need a self, right? Where you have to find? Uh, you need a cell. So a uh, self is, is called, I mean, in technical languages, in machine languages, it's called the memory, right? It's called memory. Memory is somewhere it denotes that the ranges, arrays, and anything. So mm -hmm. we will take an example of range, right? So we need range, right? Range where we have to find out. Then we need uh, second class and column B, right? So second column mate, then you have you seen, okay? So you have 12, 11 books, right? Second book, my right? second, in the second column. 
column. So you need printing column. Right? So you have to print only Hindi too, and that is uh, the exact match you have to. So exact match you have to bring. Who can understand with that? If it's there's nothing, right? You can convert into the formula, right? See question. We look up. Right? You're finding values. What do you need to find? For example, the value A1, uh, range A1 to J10, right? Then you have to go to the column 2 and then exact match. And this is your real pop-up. You have converted that into the formula and machine will learn accordingly. Right? In a similar way, if you, uh, the similar way to go to In a similar way, if I say, okay, go there and bring a book or uh, second row or third column to the book, right? I mean, you have to bring it up for me. So, what do you need first? I mean, how, how, how you will your mind with that, okay? We well, have to go to that that room and, and, and that rack. So, that I denote is the range, right? That you need, a rack. Then you have to bring a uh, Second, second uh, rack and second group of column. Then you have to bring it up, right? What does it mean actually? Now you have to. So this is what you identified that you have to. How you find the Hindi book from there? You have to bring a book from there. What do you need? So range A one to A Z, right? Then second row, second column. You have created. Index formula. This is your index formula. Now, if it goes the different match, if I could say, okay, you have to bring the class second book or class third book, class fourth book, then you have to give the condition accordingly. The other look up or the matches, the exact match, what exactly you need. So, this is how you can build the, your formula. You can make machine learn easily. So, I mean, see, so first, don't go with the syntaxes, just go with the with the logics, actually, I would say. So, logics is more important. Um, if you can flow a process in your mind, how it will work, then you can convert it into any language. So, this type of searching methodology, if I would say, I mean, to find something, you can convert, if you have the logic, you can convert that into the, the SQL, you can convert that into the any other machine languages, right? So by these logic, logics, machine should learn itself and it will start going this is for machine learning. AI, AI is, is a bias field I will not cover that part here. And now, if I would ask you, okay, go there, right? And uh, first you have to find, I mean, like with these formulas, you have to find out, okay, class two, where you have to find the class two. Or I mean, you have to see, for example, you don't have this class one, class two. You have only range. I mean, the columns at the top. So if I say, okay, find where is B and how many how many entries under B. For example, it is English, right? And here you have A, B, C, D, D other books, and here you have F, G, H, and and different books actually. A and so on, right? Like, like you have multiple books out there. If I would ask you, okay, go there <clears throat> and just check how many how many books are available in, in column B. And in that rack, in the second rack, second cells, how many books are there? What you do? What how do you build a logical mind in things? What do you need? You need the the checkpoints first, a range again. A one to Okay, I, I will not write that. So I will arrange it again. It will take me to it. So we'll say, okay, while well, I use um, range, right, that we will need. Then uh, I say, I mean, the pair of first row. Row we don't need, and so we have put it nothing over there for your own again. Then we 
need uh, the second column. So we are given a second column, right? Second rack. Then uh, we have to find how many how many books in, in that particular rack. So uh, so we have we have to check okay how many books in that particular rack. So there is your count. You need count of twelve. Right, then you need what do you need? Uh, nothing. Okay. Then you need nothing. Then you have to stop it from here. Right? So these one, two, three, four, five things you will be needing to complete these things. I mean how you have to make this. Now let's convert into the formula. So this is so once your logic is built, then you can convert into the formula. Over here we have range A1 to Z1, Z10, sorry, then no row, column, okay, so switch it and then take column 2, uh, column 1. So if I take, I mean, if I say, uh, if you're learning the offset, so offset start from 0, so second would be your 0, 1, so you have said 1, then count to self, how many counts, so for, uh, if you have to count entire thing, then you have to put 1. Otherwise, you have to get the the counting. How many how many value you have to fit? So if you give one, it will take the entire search range. Then width we don't need to give. Then you can bracket and you have offset formula. So this is this is how I mean you you first I mean learn the logical building. What is what is required to to perform task. How manually, I mean, you are learning. It is, it, it is simply like, I mean, uh, the people that would have, um, it is like, um, how, how you, you learn about two into two, right? For example, two into two equals to four. So, uh, this, this logic I have to apply to the, to the machine. So what I need to pull it, I mean, I need to fit it to the, to the machine to learn this. I'll give it, okay? Two into two equals to four. Okay, so this is how I, I can convert it to the machine. So I'll then pull equals to two, uh, the asterisk sign, two. That will give me the result of four. So just, I mean, think of, the way I and mean, how you have to build these formulas, but here, once you you build your logical mindset, you will learn everything. So see, I mean, with these cells and the understanding of these things, we understand, okay, how to build these formulas accordingly, and we have converted that the manual part, what we have learned, we have converted into the machine language. I mean, what is required for the actual one. So this is how you can. This is how you can you can build anything. I mean, so this is how we have to build. So well, this is for I mean logical building for the Excel one that we have built. We'll bring more videos for SQL and the different languages, Python, Power BI, and all. Please like and subscribe our channel for these videos, so you won't miss out. Thank you.